Hello everyone and welcome to Credit Finance. In today's video, I bring you an update regarding 1000 stimulus check update. So $1,000 stimulus checks in April. Take a look stimulus check update. These two states are going to be getting more than $1,000 in April. But that's not all. Also stimulus check update. Mark these dates on your calendar right now. I'm going to cover a couple different states update that you need to know about and also for those wondering about federal level stimulus check for everybody in the nation. I'm going to let you know how much money is available, where things stand as we are hearing we are entering into a recession, things are taking a downward turn for our economy and they are saying we might need some additional help. I'm going to get you catch up on the latest now. So now before we get started, if you are interested in latest news regarding stimulus, child tax credit, SNAP, PEBT and everything in between, so make sure you hit that like and subscribe button down below. So let's start off with the stimulus check. These two states are going to be getting more than $1,000 in April and also stick around to the end and we are going to be taking about federal level checks for everybody in just a bit now. It says the federal government issued the last stimulus check in response to the pandemic back in March of 2021. So those federal level checks that heard one went out two years ago, but a few states are still giving residents financial assistance right now in 2023. In fact, some taxpayer in Alaska and New Jersey. So if you are in those two states, then listen up right now. You are going to be receiving more than a thousand dollars in this spring now. Alaska, it's the permanent fund dividend for the past 41 years. The Alaskan government has shared investment income from oil revenues with state citizens through the permanent fund dividend program. This year, the payout per approved applicant will be $3,284. That's way more than $1,000, which is a larger amount than usual due to an included 662.19 energy relief benefits and the energy relief portion of the payout is non-taxable so congratulations in alaska now alaskans must apply for the payment by march 31st eligibility requirement include but are not limited to being a state residents of avoiding an insertion or a full calendar year now the next payout dates are going to be April 20th and May 18th. Benefits will be dispersed based on when the application is received and processed. Next up is New Jersey Anchor Property Tax Relief. The Anchor Property Tax Relief Program which is replacing the homestead benefit was created to offset year of property tax hikes. To be eligible applicants must have owned or rented their primary residence on October 19th of 2019 and must file to be exempt from New Jersey state income tax. They must also meet these annual income requirement. Homeowners up to $150,000 will receive $1,500 and between $150,000 and $250,000 will receive $1,000 checks and renter up to $150,000 will receive $400,000. $50 checks renters normally get excluded from three these type of relief program payment issued to renters or intend to defray the significant increase in house costs. The application window for the program closed on February 28th so just last month payment will be issued to qualify residents through May in the form of a checked or direct deposit in are not subjected to federal or state income tax and I will let you guys know about that when it was available and I said to hurry up before March come so now they are letting you know when you can receive it and in many cases a lot of these provisions you have got to know about them you have got to apply otherwise you will miss the window of opportunities so I have let you guys know to stay tuned on the channel i will let you know everything available but also keep an eye eye out because we often see here with a lot of these program they will realize new rounds if they have excess fund and a lot of them have got a lot of leftovers money all right so now let's talk about some stimulus check dates that you need to mark in your calendar for a couple particular dates and like i said 
Then after this, let's talk about federal level checks for everybody. Now, according to this article, that American across the board to feeling the advice side effect for inflammation, which a lot of people are saying are going to lead us to stimulus check as we enter into a recession. With many of them clumping deeper into debit as a result to help see taxpayer through these tough times, some states are still providing stimulus relief right now in 2023, some states having outstanding stimulus payment while other states are still expecting qualified tax return and application. Here is a list of some of the states. Now the first one is Alaska and the date you need to mark in March 31st, it says qualifying. Alaska residents have until March 31st to file an online or in-person application for the permanent fund dividend that we just read about and it also says that's good to know. Note that any application marked as eligible not paid by April 12th are planned to be dispersed on April 20. So mark those dates in your calendar in Alaska. Now South Carolina March 31st qualifying residents can expect to receive a check of up to $800 in March if they file their 2021 tax return October 17 of 2022 and before February 15th of this year. Now Massachusetts September 15th and 6 to F taxpayer refund program of Massachusetts allows qualifying taxpayer to get back a little over 14% of their state's income of tax year 2021. If you file your 2021 tax before September 15 and you qualify for the program, you can expect to receive your refund about a month after filing New Jersey May if you are residents of New Jersey and filed an anchor property tax relief application before February 28, which we mentioned in the last article. Then you can expect your payment no later than May. Qualifying renters of property, they will receive 450 and homeowners will get up to $1,500 verifying the information from the last article. We saw New Mexico May 31st, all the 2022 rebates have mostly been dispersed to new Mexican residents. There is a still chance to claim yours. If you haven't filed your 2021 tax return yet, if residents file before May 31st, they can qualify for rebates of $500 or even $1,000 depending on their filing status. And I have also let you know guys that there is another program we are hearing that could pop up in New Mexico for similar amount next month in May and June 30th. The mark dates the calendar if you are residents of Maine and filed a personal income tax return before October 31st of 2022 and you meet the income requirement then you may qualify for the winter energy relief payment if you are income was under $100,000 or $150,000 as a head of household you will receive $450,000 if you qualify eligible couples that file jointly that makes under $200,000 can expect a payment of $900 and if you qualify and don't receive the payment before June 30th, then contact the state tax accessor. They will have until September 30th to stand due to relief payments. Now, so that's all the update that I have for today. Remember to turn on your notification button to know when I have uploaded a new video. Thanks for watching and see you guys next time.